my name is Jamie. I live in Saudi Arabia for the moment. Oof. And I have a makeup collection that just keeps getting larger. It didn't today, and in fact, today it may get smaller. I am setting up myself to get ready to do a declutter, but that is not what we're doing right now. Hang on, I'll tell you what we're doing. If you're new here, hi, thanks for stopping by, and you've uh, come at a weird time for me. I am moving. I am moving to Egypt. So I live in Saudi Arabia. I am moving to Egypt. I've got to pack up all my collection and I've got to to Egypt. So yeah, I'm trying to get organized here today. I'm looking at my stuff and I wanted to talk about backups. So what do you think about backups? I've already decluttered my palettes. It was very hard. I got rid of a crap ton of palettes, by the way. I'll have you know. Hi, kitty. This kitty. So I've gotten rid of my palettes and I'm just kind of looking at rounding up the rest of my makeup and seeing what I'm gonna do and how I'm gonna start. I have a couple more videos that I wanna film that I can save out some makeup for, but the majority I wanna like start organizing, decluttering, packing, cause it's gonna be a job. So I will forewarn you in advance that my spending and makeup consumption habits are probably going to change in Egypt because of the lack of availability of certain products. I kind of want to explore that a little bit more and see just what I need backups of. So in general, I don't keep a lot of backups. I kind of try to use up what I have and then when I'm done with it, I throw it away or what have you, maybe declutter it. And etc. Because there are brands that are not readily available in Egypt, I have considered getting a few backups of certain products. So I'm going to talk about what those products are and why I have a backup in it. So the number one thing I have backups in are lashes. <laughs> I can't stand not wearing lashes. I wear lashes basically every day. And my favorite place to get lashes are from She Glam. So, like it or not, they're really cheap, they come in bulk, and in general the quality is pretty good. Definitely I like other lash brands better, but in terms of just readily available, She Glam. It couldn't get better. I do have a few pairs of these Makeup Geek Fearless lashes, this is what I'm wearing today. These are really nice, I don't actually even need to cut them, they're quite nice. So. As goes my lashes, I have quite a collection. I need all of them. <laughs> I need all of them and I don't wanna hear you. I don't wanna hear it. I need all these lashes. You never know, like, you never know when you're gonna need like the exact right lash to go perfectly with a look. And if you don't understand, it's not my fault. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, hey, lashes, definitely need lashes. So one product I really don't believe in having a backup for is eyeshadow palettes. They already take up so much space in general in anyone's collection. The only palette, the only palette I've ever considered purchasing a backup for was, of course, my Manifest Dream Big palette. It was at 1.8 pounds and I really considered getting a backup for it. Not that this is about to expire or anything, it's just, you know, me. I want it, I love this palette, but ultimately I missed out on the sale and it's gone now, so RIP. I still have my original palette though. I, again, I don't buy, I don't buy backups of eyeshadow palettes, it's just not a thing. So one backup that I really, really need is 100% duo lash. I need as much duo lash as I can physically carry if I, <laughs> if I can help it because man oh man, along with lashes, you have to have a way to glue them down. Another thing that I have multiples of is Inglot Duraline. I love Duraline. You haven't seen me use it in a while and there will come a time, there will come a day. I will use more Duraline but I have some for my kit, I have some for my boyfriend's house, I have some for here, I may have another one floating around somewhere. I don't know, I just don't know. Yeah, <laughs> must have Duraline, I love Duraline. 
Likewise, I bought multiples of this NYX Epic Ink Liner. I'm about ready to throw one away. I'm gonna use it all up and then it's gonna go in the trash, but Epic Liner, I need it. It's a very good liner. I know that NYX is hard to find in Egypt, so therefore I bought a backup. Another product that I recently bought a backup of is the Huda Beauty Luminous Matte Concealer, and I have mine in the shade Meringue in 2.1. Yeah, this is a great, great concealer. I will say I'm not really prone to buying backups of complexion products especially, but in this case, I love this concealer so much, and because it's not readily available in Egypt, I went ahead and bought a backup. So this is a, <laughs> say what you will about me and if I actually needed this or not. But I bought a backup of the NYX Silences Golden Blush, and it is a yellow blush. It's a very goldenrod yellow. And I love this blush so much that if something were to happen to my original one, I would be really upset, really upset, so I bought a backup. And it was on sale too, it was very cheap, it was very inexpensive, so why not? For my own peace of mind, why not buy a backup? Here again, I have some She Glam eyebrow products. These are the skinny pencils. These are the Insta Fill brow pencil. They're very, very small. They're like this. And I just buy a few of them at a time, really. They come like this and they're just, they're just little teeny weeny. They're really nice. Backups of uh, eyebrow products, you can't get in my face though. No. It only makes sense to buy backup eyebrow products, which is why I got this Lottie London Microfine Brow Pen in multiples. I have one open, I have these two left, and yeah, you can't tell me I don't need backup, <laughs> backup eyebrow products. By the way, my eyebrows, baby, those aren't real. They ain't real. Um, not only are they makeup, for sure, but I also had them tattooed on, like powder browed on, because I have the most pitiful eyebrows you've ever seen in your entire life. Yeah. I paid lots of money, and not as much as I would have paid in the States, I will say, but I paid lots of money to have even some semblance of an eyebrow. My eyebrows are so silly, so... I must have eyebrow products. It is not a negotiable. If this last one offends you, please avert your eyes, but my reason for having double of these products is because I love the tone so much, but I have multiples of Celebrity Skin, uh, the Supreme Gloss from JSC. This is my favorite gloss. It just is. It's a cool tone, neutral gloss. I must have it. I must. I have to have multiples. It is not easy for me to get them, especially in Egypt. No, I'm not, I'm not living my life without it. Until I can find a replacement, I'm not living my life without this gloss. No, I wear it all the time. There's one in my purse right now. I have three. All right, so not to leave on a bummy note, but yeah. Yeah. These are my products that I have a backup of. Let me know what you have a backup of in your collection. What products must you actually have multiples of? Let me know in the comments. Thanks for watching. I hope you have a lovely day and I will see you next time. Bye.